Hey guys, so I received the grass wall. I got a 16 pack. These are four by four. I might be wrong. One thing I don't like is that if you can see, like, there's some sparse areas. Like, it really makes me mad. First and foremost, excuse my hair, excuse my lace, excuse my face, excuse everything I'm going through with setting up. But anyway, what's important? is we're setting up grass wall so i ordered 16 of these and this is the 25 by 25 4 by 4 whatever you want to call it but yes i'm gonna be hanging them on the wall without a staple gun because i didn't feel like buying a staple gun for no reason but yeah this is very cheap i got it on amazon for 67 dollars um and when i say cheap i mean because it's cheaper than most people would pay because some people pay like a hundred and something dollars but i only paid 67 dollars and it comes with like flowers and stuff like that first and foremost we're going to get to the zip ties so these are the zip ties that it came with i'm about to open it so they feel very weak like super weak they could do better this is, this is very weak like it's so flimsy like i can't even describe how weak it is so yeah i'm not gonna lie i thought i could do this without the directions but your girl needs directions because i don't know what i'm doing i don't even know how to connect it and i felt like it was common sense <sighs> sometimes common sense ain't so common okay so what they said put two pieces on the opposite side they have degrees on here, K point, M point. Like, this reminds me of geometry. And I never liked geometry. Okay guys, so first thing you wanna do is put the zip tie through the hole and let the rest of the zip tie go through the square. From there, you're gonna put the tail into the square part of the zip tie, just like this. So you're literally gonna pull, and if you don't hear like, I'm sorry, I really don't know how to make the noise, but that means you should turn it around to a different part. I'm trying to zoom as much as possible, but... Wow, I cannot record with this one hand. Did you guys hear that? Like that, so you can hear it together. If it didn't do that, you might want to play around with it. This is the side. This is the clear side. It's like that. You ready to get your little stepping stool? Okay, because we're gonna go, we're gonna go up high. Okay. Let me show y'all what I got so far. I ain't that tall to show you for real, but what I'm gonna do, right? If you see these little things here, I'm gonna stick a thumbtack through it. So wish me luck because I'm experimenting. I don't even know if it's gonna work, but we're gonna hope it's gonna work. I took those thumbtacks that we pushed through the holes that I just showed you and pushed it into the wall. Unfortunately, this is my dorm room wall and this side of the wall was a bit hard to push through, which is why you'll see me change walls later on in the video. Nevertheless, the same guidelines still apply. I kept all the thumbtacks in my pocket just so I can have easy retrieval to just take them right out the pocket and put them right in the wall. So far, the bed is already there. I probably should have made it like start where the mirror is. But we're gonna keep going. Let's see. We'll see what happens. We'll see what goes on.
was really contemplating if I should put them together with a zip tie or if I should just wait to the end. I decided to wait to the end, but it's also now a good time where you can zip tie both columns together so that they stay together. done I really just wasn't filming on this wall I just literally took it down and switched it to another wall and now I love it here's a finish look it was easier to put on this side of the wall and my clients love it it's big bags just another belly band take a minute